Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today in this video I'll be showing how to set up LAN play or local wireless play on the Switch if you don't have Switch House online or you don't have or you're banned on the Switch or if you just like have custom firmware and you want to go online because you're risk getting banned, then you should use this service. Um this lets you play LAN plays or local wireless gameplay. On um, the LAN play, you can use it on any clean switch. But the local wireless or the local wireless module, this right here, you can only use it on a switch that has custom firmware. Um, these both work on switches that are banned or unbanned, and they also both work on if you have Nintendo Online or not. Um, but this one, you just need custom firmware. And to my knowledge, if you have a new switch or like a, the, the the one that's with the red box or the like the switch light, then this won't work because you don't you can't get custom firmware on those new switches. You can still get this though for like Pokemon and stuff. So um let's get started. You're gonna download this right here. And you're gonna download this right here. The links will be in the description below by the way. Now what we're gonna do next is we're gonna go onto the install tab right here. And we're gonna need to edit our switch configuration. So I'll show you guys how to do that right now. Um before I show you guys how to uh change your network settings and the IP address and DNS settings on your switch. Let's go ahead and install the LDN. Once again, this only works on modded switches. So um, just take, open the zip files of the LDN and plug in your micro SD card from your switch into the PC and drag and drop this into here. Um, I already have it in there. That's why there's a little error because I already deleted this earlier. But basically just drag and drop this into here and replace any files if there's any files in there. And then we're going to go ahead and move on to our switch and I'm going to show you guys how to download or how to change your internet settings to set up LAN play. We're on the switch right here and first of all we're going to enable our LDN. So let's go to our homebrew and um, right here let's, uh, click on LDN MTM and just click Y to enable it. And then let's go ahead and go to our network settings. So go to settings right here. And I'm going to go ahead and scroll down to the internet settings. All right, let's go ahead and click your network and change settings. Now, you just want to follow the website right here. Um, basically, make sure your IP address is on manual and so is your DNS. Change your IP address to, uh, I'll start over for this. Change your IP address to 10.13. Uh, and then um, on this part, so for these next two points, they have to be between 0, or not 0, between 1 and 254. So they can be like 245, or like 3, or not 3, um, 251 uh, or 2. It just can't be above that. So I'm going to go ahead and do... Um, Two four nine, and then point. Let's say like one three nine, and that works. Don't copy mine. You have to do your own. Um, for the subnet, you want to do two five five point two five point five point zero 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 point zero zero zero. Obviously, and the gateway should be um, the gateway should be ten point thirteen point three seven point uh, one. For the DNS, this is optional. This is for people who don't want to get a banned switch. Just go ahead and copy one on the website, and um, or just copy the one I have right now. That works too. Let's go ahead and save that. And that's it. We're going to head back on the PC now. Now this is for LAN play. Um, go ahead and download this thing right here, this program, WinPCAP. It's already, uh, you can also use NPCAP, that works too. Um, but you can use the install for Windows right here and just install it. Uh, I already have it, so I'm not going to install it, but yes, just follow the steps for it, and it should be pretty easy. We're on the last stretch. Let's go ahead and open LANPLAY64, and let's copy this. And then I'm going to get on the switch right here. here. Let's go here, and then go to Internet. And connect right here. All right. Let's go on to Pokemon Sword. As you can see, I am just on the uh, Pokemon Sword now. Let's press X, and go to Options, and I'm going to go ahead and enable LAN Play, which is just by pressing LR and the left analog stick down. 
I'm gonna do it. I can't rush you guys because I have to use two hands, but there you go, it's enabled. And eventually, stamps should appear. Although right now, um, right now the server's kind of empty. It only has 11 players. But it does say right here that there are people online in uh, YCOM. They saw it for Flash for a second there. Anyways, that's about it. Um, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Um, there's just a quick little note. Um, you see that the server's kind of empty. Um, it's kind of dying right now, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> and, um, hopefully it gets revived. There's usually like five people at once online at once now. I think it's kind of rare for us to be this empty though, but hopefully it should work out for you guys, and just send any comments if you have any problems. Thank you for watching, and, um, I'll see you next time. See ya.